there is anything that could be done that has to do with uh, particularly getting Africa integrated into the global economy, I think the most important thing is to place universities at the center of the development process. And then secondly, to connect those universities uh, with the rest of the world through provision of uh, high-speed internet. This is uh, extremely important. Right now, this very moment where the TCAD is taking place is uh, in Africa, in Ghana, in Accra, uh, taking place the big e-learning conference, Africa, e-learning Africa conference. And this is uh, also reflecting that there is a real dynamism in this field. A lot of projects are, are going on now. We are having some uh, major shortage for teacher education. But to train teachers uh, by face-to-face -face, uh, activities takes in too much time, too much uh, costing too much, and also oblige uh, African uh, government to bring those teachers somewhere. Uh, teacher education is the way we could just uh, solve this problem by keeping those persons where they are, giving key messages through the internet, and then increase the level of their performance. This is uh, uh, one example by which you can transform, say, the educational system in Africa is to take advantage of advances in new technologies. This has uh, been possible because uh, of the availability of new, new technologies. There are no moving parts in it. And by providing technologies like this to African schools, you can uh, significantly reduce the cost of providing textbooks or revising textbooks. We need to build more capacity, up-to-date capacity in terms of ICT. We need to introduce ICT to various levels of education and we also need to build capacity into vocational you know because you need vocational people who have vocational skill to do some technical jobs. We are now uh, in Rwanda uh, we we started uh, one year ago uh, based on the request from Rwanda government uh, computer IT training center and uh, we asked to the uh, student of this uh, Tumba IT school student, what do you what do you want to become future? Many students of Rwanda of this Tumba IT school they answer, we want to be Bill Gates. Uh, that is a very good. I think uh, uh, I'd like to transfer this answer of Rwanda young student to Japanese young uh, people now. Can I give you an example uh, where a university has been effective in producing a commercial product, for example? I think my best example is uh, the creation of Zamnet, which was the first internet provider uh, in Africa, which was born in the physics department of the University of, uh, of Zambia. And finally, this enterprise enterprise moved out of the university and established itself. It still functions as one of the best internet providers in Africa, but it was born in the physics department of the University of, of Zambia. We have this project of ICT centers where it would give rural access uh, of ICT to um, many of the people in, in up country or in the um, rural areas. And where e-learning comes in place is that we'll be having e-learning at these centers where um, young people would have access to um, um, internet, have access to um, courses to take off of the computer without actually taking the courses at the city. And moreover, um, uh, provide Microsoft and um, other IT training within the ICT center. So e-learning is definitely um, a good buzz to wake up everyone in the rural areas and we definitely look forward to achieving that. Yeah.